Have you ever awakened from a nightmare and, with a wave of relief, wondered why you had such a crazy dream? How often and why to reach him? Have you ever played peekaboo with a six-month-old and wonder why the baby finds the game so delightful? The infant reacts as though, when you momentarily move behind a door, you actually disappear, only to reappear later out of thin air. What do babies actually perceive and think? Have you ever wondered what leads to school and work success? Are some people just born smarter? Does sheer intelligence explain why some people get richer, think more creatively, or relate more sensitively? Have you ever become depressed or anxious and wondered whether you'll ever feel normal? What triggers our bad moods and our good ones? Such questions provide peace for psychologists new. Because psychology is a science that seeks to answer all sorts of questions about a soul, how and why we think, feel, and act as we do. What is psychology? Once upon a time, on a planet in this neighborhood of the universe, there came to be people. Soon thereafter, these creatures became intensely interested in themselves and in one another. Who are we? what produces our thoughts, our feelings, our actions, and how are we to understand and manage those around us. This is the story of psychology. Psychological science had its modern beginning with the first psychological laboratory founded in 1879 by German philosopher and physiologist Wilhelm Moon and from the later work of other scholars from several disciplines in many countries. Having begun as a science of mental life, psychology evolved in the 1920s into the scientific study of observable behavior. After rediscovering the mind, psychology since the 1960s has been widely defined as the science of behavior and mental process. Psychology's biggest and most enduring issue concerns the relative contributions and interplay between the influences of nature and nurture. Today's science emphasizes the interaction of genes and experiences in specific environments. The biopsychosocial approach integrates information from the biological, psychological, and social cultural levels of analysis. Psychologists study human behaviors and mental processes from many different perspectives. Psychologists subfields encompass basic research, applied research, and clinical science and application. Clinical psychologists study assess and treat people with psychological disorders. Psychiatrists also study, assess and treat people with disorders, but as medical doctors, they may prescribe drugs in addition to psychotherapy. Research has shown that learning and memory are enhanced by active study. The SQ3O study method, survey, question, read, rehearse and review, applies the principles derived from this research. And that is the story of psychology.